here is the theories of coordination compound as you know coordination compounds are nothing but a combination of multiple compounds let's see how this co coordination compound are interlinked let's move on to the werner's theory werner sir alfred werner in 1886 to 1919 the french born swiss chemist founded the modern theory of coordination compounds his theory and pioneering experimental work on metal complexes won for him the Nobel Prize for Chemistry in 1913. Werner was the first inorganic chemist to be awarded the Nobel Prize in Chemistry. He is considered as the father of coordination chemistry. Alfred Werner studied the structure of a coordination compound and complexes and put forward his ideas in the year 1893, which was known as Werner's coordination theory. Every metal atom has two types of valencies. There should be a primary valency or ionizable valency and there is a secondary valency or non ionizable valency so you are able to see a structure a complex compound a coordination compound which got the dotted line they are represented as primary valency of cobalt and the links are represented as secondary valencies So primary valency, it corresponds to the oxidation state of the metal ion. The primary valency of the metal ion is always satisfied by negative ions. So here is the coordination compound with the central ion here and these are ligands and this is the coordination number. So Cl2 which is 4 and this is anion, the minus is anion, the plus is cation. The entire thing with a bracket is called as coordination sphere. Let's talk about the secondary valency or non ionizable valency. The second valency can correspond to the oxidation number of the metal ion or atom. The secondary valencies may be satisfied by either negative ions or neutral molecules. The molecules or ions that satisfy secondary valencies are called as ligands. The ligands which satisfy the secondary valency must project in different directions in space. So the secondary valency are directional in nature, whereas the primary valencies are non-directional. So primary valency is dotted line, which shows the oxidation number as 3. Primary valency is exhibited by 6 NH3 ligand. So secondary valency coordination number is 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So this is how your CO, Cl3, 6NH3, NH3 is there. So the secondary valency is exhibited by the 3 Cl ligands. The ligands have unshared pair of electrons. These unshared pair of electrons are donated to central metal ion or atom in a compound. Such compound is called as coordination compounds. I got my ethylene diamine ligand contains two atoms with a lone pair that can coordinate to the metal center. You are able to see it here. This one is combining here. You are able to see here. This one and this one. It's combining here to form a cobalt complex ion. 